Hey everyone, Hannah here from Preferred Physical Therapy where we help people aged 40 and above stay active and independent, live free from painkillers, and avoid surgery. This month we have been talking to you all about the shoulder and today I'm going to show you two exercises that you can do to help strengthen up the shoulder if you've been told that you have shoulder impingement syndrome or whenever you feel like a pinching pain right in the front of the shoulder, maybe some radiating, shooting pain down the upper arm, anytime reaching up into the top cabinet, doing anything overhead. So this first exercise I want to show you is called a serratus punch and all you'll need is something like a PVC pipe, you can even use like a broomstick, mop, anything that is just super light and something for you to hold on to. So you're going to start laying down on your back and I want you to make sure that you're staying relaxed through your shoulders, kind of bringing them down away from your ears. You want to grip about shoulder width apart and keep the bar straight out from your chest. And all you're going to do is keep the elbow straight, punch up towards the ceiling, and then squeeze the shoulder blades back. There's no bend in the elbows with this exercise, but you're staying right here to help strengthen up the serratus anterior muscle, which sits right on the outside as kind of that boxer's muscle that you'll see. Next exercise is called the side-lying supraspinatus. And what those words are is side-lying, you're just laying on your side on the table or a bed, whatever's comfortable for you. And then supraspinatus is one of the muscles of your rotator cuff and it sits kind of right on the top side of the shoulder and it helps with coming out into like a Y plane and that is the muscle or tendon that's being impinged as you do some overhead activities. So to get into this exercise position, like I said, lay on your side and this one, you're gonna start with the thumb down and in towards your thigh and as you come up out at a Y, you're gonna rotate so the thumb is pointing back behind you against that wall and then rotate it back down nice and easy towards the thigh. And what I like to do is find a spot right on the ceiling that I know that's my point that I want to stop with this motion so I'm not going too far forward or back or way overhead. I'm just going right there and then straight back down to the thigh. And with both of these exercises, you want to do each of them, maybe two sets of 15, two sets of 10, whatever seems comfortable for you. Don't feel like you have to overdo these. If it is becoming unpain or if it is becoming painful for you, go ahead and stop, take a little break and see how we do afterwards. So go ahead and give those two exercises a try. If you have any questions at all or want to speak to a therapist, you can reach out to our clinic. Um, either email, phone, stop in. You can also head over to any of our social media pages where you can find more videos like this and just more information about us. Have a great day.